welcome back to my YouTube channel, Smiley Education Center and Homeschooling. Today we're gonna try to solve the riddle. It is about the free Wi-Fi password of a restaurant or cafeteria that is given as an integral problem. Well, it looks tricky at first, but actually it is not as tricky as it looks if we know the type of the integral. Because this integral problem has three symbols of integral, so let's solve it one by one. Let's say this is step one, this is step two, second step, and the denominator is step three. Okay. Now how to recognize what type of integral it is? Let's take a look to the component in the bracket. The easiest way is you look the x if the x in the bracket has one larger exponent than the x outside the bracket so this is substitution substitution integral so we have to substitute the component in the bracket so let's say that the x square plus 5 is u so we have du over dx it means the derivative is 2x. So we're gonna substitute the dx. That the dx is du over 2x. Okay, we're gonna solve the first step. Rewrite again the integral x. Remember that we have substitute the component in the bracket as u. So we write it as u to the power of a half. And dx, we have already substituted as du over 2x. So we have a half as a constant, then we write it outside the symbol of integral, a half times integral u to the power of half du. So it's going to be, because the coefficient of u is 1, so this is 1 over a half plus 1 u to the power of a half plus 1 du so it's gonna be u over to the power of 3 for 2 so we have 1 third times u to the power of 3 over 2 the first step is done. Let's continue to the second step. We have 3 times integral x and the component in the bracket has been substituted into u. So I'm going to write it u to the power of negative for half and the dx. We already changed it into du over 2x. Don't forget to eliminate the x again. So we have a half as a constant. So I'm going to write it 3 times a half sine integral of u to the power of negative half du so we have 3 over 2 times the integral of u to the power of negative half is it's going to be 2 times u to the power of positive half so we have 3 times u to the power of a half and in the last step we write as integral of x and to break it u minus 3 over the square root of u du du over 2x so don't forget to eliminate oh. the x again so we have integral of u minus 3 over 2 times the square root of u du now because this is a fraction with two nominators, so we're gonna separate the nominator as integral u over two times the square root of u minus three over two times the square root of u. Don't forget the theory of subtraction of integral because this is subtraction, so we're gonna have integral of the first component, which is u over two times the square root of u minus integral of 3 over 2 times the square root of u. Well, for the first component, we got the constant as a half. So we write it a half 
outside the symbol of integral integral u this is a u uh, to the power of 1 with an exponent over over the square root of u means the u to the uh, to the power of a half so we can write it as u to the power of a half du minus the second component we got is constant as 3 over 2 so we're going to write 3 over 2 times integral of 1 over 1 over the square root of u so we're going to write it as u to the power of minus a half du okay so we got a half times the integral of u to the power of a half is okay, 1 over a half plus 1 u to the power of a half plus 1 minus 3 over 2 times 1 over minus a half plus 1 times u to the power of minus a half plus 1. And then it's going to be a half times 2 third times u to the power of 3 over 2. Don't forget to eliminate the 2. Minus 3 over 2 times this is going to be 2. It's going to be 2 times u to the power of a half. So the result is we got uh, 1 third u to the power of 3 over 2 minus 3 times u to the power of half. This is the step 3. Well, we did all the 3 steps of this riddle. Now, let's take a look to the beginning of the riddle. The step 1, we got 1 third times u to the power of 3 over 2. So, we have 1 third times u to the power of 3 over 2. The second step, we got the result as this one minus 3 times u to the power of half. Meanwhile, the second step, which is the denominator, we got the result as this one. 1 third times u to the power of 3 over 2 minus 3 times u to the power of half. Look at the denominator and denominator because they are same, really the same. So the result is 1. So guys, you can conclude that this is actually not the password of real Wi-Fi. The conclusion is the owner of the restaurant or cafeteria just want to trick us. Okay, see you on the next video. Bye-bye.